Okay, I just want to take a moment to show you guys why going slower might actually be better for you in the long run. Uh, this piece was a Z motor mount and it was printing at I believe 50 millimeters per second, which is pretty fast. Uh, 100 millimeters per second is like probably the top end of what you want to be doing. Uh, my print bed is pretty uh, unstable though because I'm using a printed uh, print bed base, so it's not as stable as a wooden base. And uh, I'm not using LMM, LM8UU bearings, the linear bearings that are going around. I'm using printed linear bearings, which are kind of unstable. My bed kind of wobbles a little bit. Uh, on that note, that when it gets to a certain speed, sometimes it skips a step. And this, you can see it skipped a step. And everything slid over by about, no, two and a half millimeters, which is not very cool. Uh, if you catch it in time, you can reset it which is what I did with this piece. I caught, caught it right when I was going to do it. Give it a moment there. And I, I, I set it up and I uh, reset it. It's, uh, it's a good piece. It looks ready to go. Uh, on the next one, because I needed two, and this one's not going to work, I uh, set it to go much slower. I'm talking about 26 millimeters per second main, 25 millimeters perimeter, and I think 30 millimeters travel and it printed out perfectly the first time and it looks gorgeous it's a beautiful piece I also increased the uh, height to 0.39 millimeters and the width of the th extrusion to 0.0 or 0.7 which gives me a squish about 57 percent of the filament isn't squished which means 37 or 33 percent is so that's pretty cool and uh, or 47 sorry about that 47 43 percent I've been up for about 19 hours now so my math isn't great but uh, so yeah so slow is smooth smooth is fast take your time get your prints right and it looks like this one took 85 minutes well by the time I had this done I already wasted 47 minutes so this was 47 minutes plus 87 minutes, which took way too long. So, slow, smooth, smooth as fast. Take your time.